UNM is working to make its campus safer and it's asking its own students how to do it. News 13's Brittany Bade shows you how. In the light of day, you'd never notice it. Like I have to do a double check around me and see um, if I'm safe and if there's anyone around me. And but Ellen Lindland and other students at UNM know as soon as the sun goes down. Some areas get dark and dangerous. Um, one was on the west side of the duck pond. That's something that has come up several times. This area, along with the university house, a pathway from Zimmerman Library to the Yale parking garage, and the southeastern side of campus, especially near the tennis courts, were all identified by students as places that need more lights. Some of them weren't surprising, some were new things that have popped up. Rob Burford with UNM took students on a safety walk at night around campus during Campus Safety Week to get a student's perspective on safety. I think uh, students know the campus better than most of the people maybe who design it because we spend all day here, we walk around all the time. Some areas will be an easy fix, just in need of a few new light bulbs, but other areas may not see more light for another year. These typically are, they are for sure things, but it can take some time. Students say when parts of campus aren't pitch black, that would definitely make me feel a little better. They'll feel safer no matter the time of day. Brittany Bade, KRQE News 13. Now, there's no price yet for just how much it will cost UNM to fix all of those areas.